Hello, hello YouTube. I haven't done a video in ages. I know. A lot of things have happened since I've done a video, I have to tell you. But I won't tell you right now. I want to talk about um, Intersex um, Organisation, Intersex International. So everybody else on YouTube, switch off if you don't want to know about this. But of course you should all know about this sort of stuff. Um, somebody said that um, OII Australia has a slightly different position to OOI International, which would basically be OII USA. Um, and um, it's all about transsexuals and intersex and, you know, how do OI feel about calling trans a physical difference of sex, which would qualify it as intersex, you know? Um, and somebody wrote a reply to that whole thing, um, which I couldn't agree with more with. So basically, I completely agree with this person. Nearly completely. Nearly. This person says, I feel that transgendered people are intersex. If the brain chemistry is different than that of an average female or male, then that person is neither of those sexes. I believe that if our society started recognising intersex as a gender equal to male and female and transgender people were to find out that they were actually born intersex due to their brain chemistry and or hormones, then you would find less instances of people actually changing their bodies to fit into the two-box system. If society accepted intersex and didn't make us feel bad about our bodies or our hormonal differences that make us more masculine or feminine than the, than the average male or female, then you would find a lot more people becoming comfortable with their bodies and who they are as a person, therefore having less surgeries to correct what society has convinced us is a problem. Not that there is anything wrong with getting surgery, if that is really something that you wish to choose for yourself. All that I'm saying is that I, a conscious move toward acceptance will give people more of an option to choose to not have surgery and maybe become more comfortable with the bodies they were born into because society wouldn't judge them and force its gender roles upon them. Now, this is on Facebook, I won't say where, and I'm the only person who's thumbed that up, yeah. <laughs> oh, loads of other people get, um, get thumbed up for all sorts of comments, but it's generally staying in the pink and blue bracket that intersex male, intersex female, and there is no in-between, which I absolutely think is diabolical, that people, especially high up power people up in the organisation, intersex international organisations, that they are not even open, it seems, it seems, not even open to um, um, allowing people like myself and this person I'm quoting um, to actually not be pink or blue, all right? And um, so... You know, a lot of people are against that. They're like, oh, no, 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 no. There is no third gender. You know, you're mad. You're crazy. So there you go. <laughs> we'll find out in the future whether we are or not. But this person, again, who I quoted already, I won't put up the fingers if you don't mind, uh, continues to say something else. Finding out that I was born intersex kept me from considering myself transgendered. Many people consider themselves transgendered transgendered consider themselves that simply because they don't feel that they fit into society's view of gender norms for male and female. Intersex people are not transgender, but people who are diagnosed as transgender might just be intersex. Hallelujah. God, it's great to read somebody writing exactly what I've been saying on YouTube forever. <laughs> um, I'm going to read out somebody else's um, um, post again um, and I'm just going to give him the name Jim okay I am always in favor of making changes if the science shows it to be correct this is why I keep a loose leaf notebook rather than carving things in stone we can always amend or rewrite in the light of new understanding there is a whole lot of science supporting direct links between brain chemistry and or structures and and identity we ignore it at our peril on the other hand, we don't want a belief in new science to develop so that bad results become ignored either. How about we keep an open mind and a wait-and-see attitude? Yeah? Okay, I'm just going to scroll down and get this person's post again because they kept writing, which is excellent. Um, they're mentioning names. I won't mention the names. Um, this other person who we'll call uh, Mora. Um... They say, I think we're actually in agreement, but disagreeing for no reason. 
I say, I say that if more trans people become aware of the fact that they may have been born intersex and society starts to accept intersex as an equal gender to male and female, then like me, people who once considered transitioning might rethink conforming to the illusion of a gender binary. I questioned my gender and because I had no proof that my surgeries as a child were due to an intersex condition, I just assumed I was born female. Many people who are trans are probably in the same boat because doctors tried to normalise us to the extent of not even mentioning intersex in our birth records. Some did, however many doctors took it upon themselves to hide the reasons behind the surgeries from the individuals. I do believe that brain sex and other smaller variations can constitute being considered intersex. Just as I believe that many who are considered homosexual don't realise that they too have an intersex variation. Nothing is as simple as it appears and we should spend our time working together to wake people up around the world about their potential connection to the normality of intersex. When and only when intersex is accept as a, accepted as a biological gender norm will all of our variation be able to freely exist. Our pure existence completely disproves the gender binary, therefore opening doors for all, intersex or not, because laws defining things such as marriage and other similar issues as between a man and a woman cannot remain in place when intersex is recognised. To everyone in this forum, we need to stand together and fight to be heard and seen as normal because we and only we can stop this ridiculous nonsense going on in our world based on people's misinformation and religious views. They continue, just, I'm going to continue because I think this person speaks brilliantly, writes brilliantly. Um, they say, I don't want intersex to be about being trans. If anything, the point I've tried to make is that the realisation that a person may have been born intersex makes a person question their choice to consider themselves trans or not. If trans people realised that their brain difference didn't mean that they had to choose male or female, oh God, hallelujah for saying this, rather that that they could choose intersex as a gender option and that society made an effort to consciously stop imposing gender stereotypes on people who would find less, less instances of people taking the step toward transitioning. Brilliant. Yes, and then they even correct themselves by saying, as opposed to the word stereotype, I should have used the words roles or obligations in reference to gender. This person is extremely well worded. Um, and it's a pleasure to read and there's no more posts from them and that's my video because I couldn't not do a video on that post that's just excellent you know so I didn't shave I didn't check myself didn't put on fancy clothes I didn't clean my nails didn't wash my teeth you know make them all lovely uh, I just coming as I am and I did say to people that when I do start to do my YouTube videos again that I would make a more professional um, appearance and make it more concise and I have actually failed to do that again <laughs> Oh well, um, I could, as I say, I had to um, uh, put that into um, vocal words, um, you know, for the blind out there. There's a lot of blind people out there, even if they do see with their eyes. There's a lot of blind people out there, and they like to hear things. So let's hope that they watch this uh, by listening to it. Oh, I'm talking shit now, okay? And there's the word shit, and the whole video is ruined. But I will definitely do <laughs> better videos soon enough. Okay, and to anybody out there who hasn't seen me in ages, um, here I am. How do I look? 